Hello, everybody. Welcome to the Team Grist Show. I am Paul Grist, broker and team lead. And I'm Hope Cunningham, buyer's agent with Grist Real Estate. Yes, she is our rock star buyer's agent. And welcome to our next episode of the Team Grist Show. So we are into 2021. Glad to put 2020 behind us and on to brighter, sunnier skies ahead. And what a year it has been in 2020 for the real estate market. First of the year started off quite as a challenge, but we certainly made up for a lot of lost ground. So what we want to do today is give you an overview of where we ended up in 2020 in our residential market here in the Greenbrier Valley, and then where things are now, and some recommendations if you're thinking about buying or selling, and how you want to go about doing that in today's current climate. So one of the craziest things about last year was where we ended up a number of sold properties. Yeah, yeah, the number of sold properties were um, ridiculously, you know, from 2019 compared to 2020, um, the number of sold listings was up by 48%. I mean, how ridiculous does that sound with our market? <laughs> Not ridiculous, like awesome, but that's right. how um, active our market was. Um, I mean, you take, 48% uh, of anything, that's a big difference. So, you know, the number of sold listings, it blows my mind. I, I, sure. I could see it happening when it was happening, but to see the number, the actual number, it's just, it's impressive. That's how busy the market was. <laughs> yes, absolutely. And that's, you know, we saw a big jump in, you know, all homes right across the market, but the biggest price bracket that we saw a jump in was in between 200 and 250,000 the number of homes sold in that particular bracket was up 142%. And that's just huge. You, know, you might see fluctuations depending on year to year, 5%, 10%, but 142 is pretty phenomenal. And we also saw a big jump in homes above 400,000. You know, that's, uh, we're looking at some of the price brackets where they doubled in the number of sales uh, or more. And that's just, it's good news all across the area. It shows buyer confidence and a very healthy market. We saw a lot of people moving into the area, but a lot of local folks that are moving up, getting more space and just doing something different. Mm -hmm. So I think it's you're looking at the market too. One of the things to really fascinating to keep in mind is something called absorption rate. So that's, if you, Stopped adding any new properties on the market today, how many months would it take to sell everything that's left? And you know, your standard balanced healthy market is somewhere between like about a year's worth of inventory, give or take. And last year at the same time, we were right around, I think, 10 months, 10 and a half months of inventory on the market. We've dropped down to just below six months of inventory. So that means this is a seller's market. This means the number of houses available is low, yes. but there's still a lot of buyers out there looking. So it's a great opportunity if you're in the market to sell. So what does that mean if you're a buyer and you need to buy now, you want to buy now, what do you want to be doing? You want to be looking for a buyer's agent. Hello, my name is Miss <laughs> Yes. No, I get out a lot. Um, uh, I see a lot of the, the homes on the market. Um, I'm going to help you look for homes that meet your needs, that's in your budget, get you pre-qualified, mm -hmm. get you looking, send things out, get a hold of the listing agent, um, and make sure that your offer is good, we get a good solid offer in. Um, you want to be talking to someone that's going to represent you as a buyer that knows the market and knows how fast it's moving and how strong of an offer that you need. Definitely you want to be doing that, um, especially in this kind of market, uh, if you're ready to buy don't hesitate. You need to put an offer in. Yeah, absolutely. So the buyer's agent, especially Hope, it's going to get you prepared and be ready so you can act quickly and move on that home when it comes available and you don't miss out. That's, uh, we see people that aren't prepared, that they hesitate, and they're missing out on homes that they really would have liked to have lived in, but they didn't take the right steps to begin with. So we can definitely help you on that side of things. You know, as far as Selling, you know, taking advantage of the of this market, the opportunity while it's here. You know, prices are strong, buyers are very active. You know, 
listening with an agent, you get the right market data because what happens still, even in this market, if you overprice it, you're going to sit there and then you're going to end up selling for less than if you'd priced it where the market is now. And you, know, you could be under contract and sold and moved on to the next steps instead of sitting there and wondering what was happening. So definitely you want the right information, good market analysis and data so you can make good decisions moving forward. Plus it helps to have great marketing and the full exposure that we provide behind that. Uh, I think one of the things to point out too, you know, low inventory, the number of homes on the market right now is still down about, mm, it's, it's down a couple percent. You know, month over month, we're down 25%. So you, the number of homes available to buyers right now is way down. And the number of new properties coming on the market right now, it's up 10%, 9% year over year. So that means more think people are thinking about selling, but inventory is still so crazy low that it's a great opportunity. One thing to keep in mind though, come springtime, everybody else is waiting for spring to put their home on the market, but there's people looking now and now's a great time because people need homes. And if you're thinking about selling, you don't need to wait to spring. Definitely give us a call and let's have that conversation to see if now's the right time for you. I get that question a lot with buyers. When's a good time to buy? My answer is it's always a good time to buy and sell. <laughs> it always is. Yeah. But typically a lot of people like to wait around um, school, summer, and with the craziness of this day and age right now, anytime people are looking to buy, people are looking to sell. Let's, let's get this going. Let's Absolutely. Get this, let's get a deal going. Mm -hmm. So, and that's, you know, sort of overall market thoughts, you know, what, where things are right now, interest rates, low interest rates definitely are pushing some of this and it's historically low and we keep hearing that because they just keep going down. Uh, but how much further down can they go? Is it worth waiting a few months to find out? Probably not, you know, based on where things could go. Uh, but it's something too, that as you're looking at the future, you know, where's the market going to go? We never know. We don't have a crystal ball, but we do know that people coming to this area from out of the area are recognizing the quality of life that we have here, the great people, and what special place this is to live here in the Greenbrier Valley. You know, we cover a large area, but it's one of those cool things that if you want to be a part of a community, you can. If you want your own space, you can, and you can do something in between. And people have really recognized that. Yeah, there's a, a place for everyone. Um, let's get out there and find it. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So welcome to the new year. Onward and upward, upward. Lots of great things to come. And this is a recap. If you have any questions about the market, want to see where things are, inf questions about what we talked about today, let us know. Ask in the comments. Give us a call. Shoot us a message. Be glad to hear from you. Of course. We appreciate all your likes and shares that helps us get out there and in front of people and help those in our community with their real estate needs. So I'm Paul, Paul Grist, broker and team lead with Team Grist. And I'm Hope Cunningham, the buyer's agent here at Team Grist. We'll see you soon.